guys, what's up? Like in today's video to just start like the week the right way, I want to talk about some cool graphic design hacks. So as you know, Facebook had this 20% uh, 20 text rule. I mean, if you go up to this rule, uh, your ad is going to cost you more to reach probably as much people as you should uh, usually, or maybe it's not going to like reach as many people and you're going to like pay super, like a super high price. So if you want to prevent like just to avoid this kind of problems, you have to follow this 20% rule. So let's jump on my computer right here. Awesome. So as you can see, this is a grid you're going to use on all your different graphics like images. It works also for the video thumbnails as well. Uh, so in this rule, it just means you can put all the text you want, but this text has to fit into one, two, three, four, five kind of like square cases. So you can find this grid super uh, easily on Google. You just type like Facebook grid text PNG, for example, and you'll find it. And in my example in Canva, so you can use it on Photoshop, Canva, whatever. So this is that grid I can move in all my different graphics. And as you can see in this um, graphic, I probably won't have any problems because my text is uh, properly fitting in uh, four different squares. So I could have enough actually room to add an action button. So just so you know guys, you can use this grid uh, wherever you want. If there is still problems with the 20% rule according to Facebook, means maybe it's a problem with contrast. Maybe you put an ebook or a shirt or like a product with some text on it. So there is different hacks. You can like blur stuff. You can just move the angle. So Facebook doesn't like consider that as text. So there is a bunch of different hacks. But for the basic one, just use this grid to um, not just face any problem with your graphics. That was it for today, guys. If you like this video, just share it with all the people around you advertising on Facebook and you'll just save a bunch of time uh, instead of just trying so much different uh, version of one graphic, knowing you just you would just need like this one simple grid. So I see you guys. Bye-bye.